What's going on guys, welcome back to the channel and to more lightsaber duels in Battlefront 2. Today's video is a lesson in not giving up and persisting until the end of the duel, even if it looks like you're about to lose. In today's video, you'll see just that happen. Either myself or my opponent will drop down to within one hit from losing and will turn it around and pull out a comeback victory from behind. And it just goes to show that you should not give up even if it looks like you're about to lose. This first duel was pretty quick. Once I saw Vader was out of stamina, I started attacking like crazy and got him out of there. This next duel, though, uh, is the first example of what I'm talking about. Both of us will actually drop down really low in this duel, and I uh, really left it up in the air as to who would come out the victor. I really like these long, prolonged duels against Darth Vader, though. He's always a tough puzzle to solve. Obi-Wan's a pretty good counter, though. He got me with both hits on the saber throw there. That was really good. Here, I'm trying to read his attack timing. We both hit each other there. I hit him once, but he hits me with both hits on the lightsaber again. I'm down to 130. One more hit, and it's over. I parried him clean there, though, and got him low, and he's low on stamina. I'm trying some hook swings, but I missed that one, and he made me pay for it with that choke. I'm able to knock him away with the push. My health is relatively low, though, so I'm not going to go super aggressively, just when I have the opportunity to. I'm trying to bait some parries. That was one hit. That was a pretty sweet jump over the saber throw. Another parry. He blocks the push. I'm trying to stay unpredictable with the defensive rush, especially when he's not under the effect of the mind trick, because when I'm rushing, he can easily choke me or hit me with the lightsaber throw. Here, I'm just trying to dodge around him and hit him when I can. I was trying to parry him, but we just ended up hitting each other. Hits me with, again with both hits of the lightsaber throw. I'm down to 70 health. I missed that attack, missed that attack. <laughs> Defensive rush bugged out a little bit there. Still managed to get a hit though. Hit him with the mind trick to stop the choke. I hit him with one hook swing, hit him with two hook swings, but he hit me in the air while I was doing that second one. That was a lucky block on the saber throw. I was trying to guess where he was going to move to once I started charging the push, and I guessed wrong. That was a swift double hit, though. Gets me with the choke, but only gets me with one follow-up hit. Hit him with the mind trick. Trying to bait a couple parries. Got that one. Hit him with the defensive rush. I was going for that jump attack when I saw him jump, but uh, it was a wild swing and a miss. Parried that attack. And this defensive rush is risky because he could choke me. He went for it right there, but I dodged out of the rush at just the right time. And that's what I was talking about just a second ago. I'm able to parry him clean there. Stop his abilities with the mind trick. He's out of stamina, so he's trying to get it back before re-engaging. Got one hit with that rush, but then he choked me after. There's some skipping going on in this footage, I'm just now realizing. Got one hit there, pushed him away with the push. Yes, that's what pushes do, they push people away. Stop his abilities once more. I missed that hook swing, but I figured I'd just go into the defensive rush, try to get a hit. Got two hits off that parry. Missed that hook swing. I got that hook swing, but he activated Focused Rage at just the right time, so the extra health saved him. This is a really intense duel. We're both very low. And that was the finish right there. Kind of a weird finish to it, but uh, I was happy with that performance. Here's another duel against Vader. This is that player from uh, the first duel in this video. And this duel was very frustrating. I'll say it in the beginning because you'll see as it progresses. But I had this Vader on the back foot pretty much the entire duel. I was reading their parry timing uh, over the course of this match. As you can see, I'm actually down two rounds. Uh, this guy wasn't very high leveled, but his parry timing was surprisingly good, and I didn't catch on to it until that duel with Luke. 
So at this point I had caught on to it. And uh, I had him on the back foot almost the entire time. I cancelled that defensive rush so I could hit him with the jump attack there. Unfortunately, you can't jump out of the defensive rush. I think it's kind of strange. Because you can jump out of uh, Ray's dash strike, but you can't jump out of this rush. See, he parried me clean there. He parried me there. His timing was just surprisingly good for a low-level player. Got a clean jump attack there, though. They weren't super low. I'd say maybe like 60, 70? Can't remember exactly. It was a recently prestiged Vader, though. Every time they jumped away, I was able to hit them with the push. Unfortunately, it knocked them away, so I wasn't able to follow up with it. I was just going for the damage. Got one hit off the defensive rush and a follow-up. See, like, I'm still at full health, and he's very low. He's just backing off the entire time, and I was not able to get the finish. I was trying some hook swings there, but I think that log in the sand was uh, stopping my moves. Got two parries there. He's one hit away. But he's not risking any more attacks while he's low on health. I hit him with the push while he's in midair. And again, I know I can't follow up after the push. I'm just doing it so I can tack on the extra damage. It's a good 180, I think, when it's fully charged. It's powerful. He tries to get a choke, but I block it. I try to parry, but miss the timing. Kind of heavy on the attack button there. He hits me with the return hit on the lightsaber. I should try that star card that does more damage on the return hit for Vader. I don't use that card very often, but I feel like it'd be good in duels. Granted, I don't use Vader in duels very often, so that's probably why. I got a clean parry there, though. I hit him with the defensive rush. I figured he would try to attack me here, but he was smart. Not while he was low on health. Stop his abilities with the mind trick. Hit him with defensive rush. And I whiffed on that push really bad. I could have ended it right there. He's just backing off. He's not too sure what I'm going to do. But he gets a hit there. He gets a hit on the return uh, lightsaber throw. Gets two hits right there out of nowhere. I have no idea how those connected. And then he gets one hit through my dodge. Needless to say, I was not happy about that finish, but it was a good lesson in persistence. He persevered, and at the end, he got the win. This was a really intense duel against Darth Maul. I was trying to land those parries, but this dude's parry timing was off the charts, too. Look at that, down to 65 health, and I've done hardly anything to him. Defensive rush connects. I'm very wary of that saber throw, because it recharges quickly, and the return hit does a lot of damage. Plus, it can stagger me. And this dude clearly knows how to play Maul, so I'm playing a little cautiously. Using defensive rush to my advantage, but he was able to hit me with the lightsaber throw in the middle of the rush. We both missed our attacks there. Hit him with the rush. That seems to be my primary uh, damaging move. I've got the forward star card on Obi-Wan Kenobi, so it's a guaranteed 170 damage per hit. Blocked both lightsaber throw hits. Parried him with a follow-up attack there. Parried him again. And I was looking for the parry, but he's not attacking while he's low. There, I expected him to do a spin attack through me, so the reason I turned in a 180 was just in case he did the spin attack, and it could then connect when he uh, came out of it, but he didn't do the spin. Got one hit there, and had I followed up, I would have won. But he risked an attack, and I was able to parry him clean for the win. That dude actually beat me a few times before that. I didn't want to include him in the video, though. So you guys think I'm better than I actually am. This duel is against the homie, Zero. I actually had two other duels against him, I think, in this video. It was the uh, Vader... Maybe it was just that one duel against Vader before. I block the push, I get one hit into his back. Missed the saber throw, though. 
He was trying to hook swing, and he missed the follow-up attack, so I was able to throw him away, but I accidentally fell into the hole. Got one clean attack into his back there. Got another clean attack into his back, followed up with the saber throw. That's one of my favorite combos, just do some damage and then throw the saber at him. The throw comes out very fast. It's faster than a regular attack, so you can actually chain that together really well. I landed that hook swing, but he knocks me down with repulse, pushes me away. And right there, he got one attack after the knockdown, but I was able to do the lightsaber throw because it comes out super fast. So even though he hit me, I hit him right back. Parried that attack. I was trying to jump attack, but he blocked it. I got two hits out of that rush. That was good. So he's pretty low right here. Got him with the return hit on the lightsaber throw. I'm playing a little aggressively here. Missed that parry. And the lightsaber throw bugged out, and it still got him on the return hit. I'm not too sure what happened there. I'm trying some jump attacks, and I'm not too sure what my thought process is. I think I'm trying to catch him while he's dodging, and then I'm trying to hit oh the God. hitbox while he's uh, passing through me, but it wasn't working. Similar to what happened with that second Vader fight. Got him with that hook swing. And I'm pretty sure he's using the Rush Immunity Star card. I notice after he uses the Rush, he gets a little bit of damage reduction for a few seconds. And he also has Intensify on, so I had about 170 health right there. And I wasn't even expecting that loss. One attack did a whole bunch of damage. That was well played on his part. These duels were really interesting, because if you notice, this is actually HVV and not Hero Showdown. I was fortunate enough to run into this uh, squad in Heroes vs. Villains, and they were super cool. We were just running around the map, making hero towers, and uh, spinning in circles, and so I figured, hey, why not try a duel? This guy was a high level, so I figured it'd be fun. I'm moving around well with Darth Maul, though. I hit him with the lightsaber throw. And notice his stamina is low, so I'm going in for the kill. And got it pretty quickly right there with that one. That duel started with him a little bit below full health, so this next one he was starting at full. And this was one of my favorite duels in this entire video, simply for the ending sequence. I dodged the heroic might, hit him twice there. And again, he's low on stamina. Unfortunately, this is Anakin's weakness. Especially if he has the Massive Strikes card. His stamina is just terrible. I was about to say something else, but it's, it's not good. And uh, if you lose duels with Anakin, chances are it's because of the stamina issue. I was able to pick him up with the choke after that heroic might, though. Got one hit in there. He's doing some damage. I'm at 88 health now. 8 health. And had I not landed that saber throw, he would have finished it. I threw the saber right before he pulled me. And uh, the stagger on the saber throw saved my life right there, so that was very lucky. I'm missing these attacks. Parried him twice there, hit him once more, and then two hits on the lightsaber. Five hits in the space of two seconds gets me the win. I was very happy with that. Dooku versus Anakin is always fun. Parry that attack clean. And once again, he's low on stamina. So I'm trying to be a little bit more aggressive, but... Uh, he was defensive and got it back. I blocked that attack and then hit him with the knockdown. With two follow-up attacks, so he's very low right now. I'm going for some hook swings, and I might have landed that last one, but I was out of stamina. Hit him with the exposed weakness. Trying to get him in the back with a hook, but he's dodging effectively. He parries me. I parry him right back. I blocked the pull. Got that hook swing in. And as he went for the heroic might, I was able to finish it with just a single attack. But that is it for today's lightsaber duels. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. A little bit shorter than the last few. But uh, I had a good time with these duels, and I figured uh, this was a good topic for today. I'm 
surprisingly running out of stuff to talk about in these duels. So if you guys have any ideas of what you want to see in these duels, or if you want me to talk about a certain uh, technique, let me know in the comments below, and I'll be sure to cover it in the next one. But that's it for this one. Thank you guys so much for stopping by and checking it out. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it, thumbs down if you didn't, and I will see you next time. Peace.